The ruling of Progressive's Congress Committee on True Federalism has held a consultative meeting with women in the Federal Capital Territory. This is in line with the committee's mandate to seek the opinions of Nigerians regarding the agitation for the restructuring of the country. Basilo Kafo tells us more in this report. Following the agitations for restructuring of Nigeria, the All Progressive Congress set up a committee on true federalism with a mandate to review the calls. The committee, headed by the Kaduna State Governor Nasiru Erofai, was asked to articulate and align the public position with the party's manifesto and campaign promises. At a consultative meeting with party leaders in Abuja, the women, through their representatives, kick against a return to regional government in Nigeria. According to them, such move will only find the ember of suspicion and the fear of oppression among minority groups in the country. We believe that by putting Nigeria first, the question can be tackled in harmony rather than in acrimony. On the issue of the ideal federating units to adopt and whether or not there should be a merger or a creation of more states, it is our considered opinion that the status quo remains. It should be maintained. The women of this country have never doubted anything Nigeria or Nigerian. We have always been committed to Nigeria. And that is what we should always express. APC officials who grace the occasion recognize the fact that women cannot be relegated to the background in the issue of restructuring the country. For us in APC, this is not a mere slogan because we respect the voice of women and recognize that they can contribute towards the resolution of the burning issues and help bring about the much needed national cohesion and national development. Many prominent personalities in Nigeria have also expressed the view that the restructuring of the country will address many of its challenges. Basil Okafo, Core TV News, Abuja.